Amazing armor, he's Iron Man. Amazing iron, he's Iron Man. Amazing iron, he's Iron Man. Amazing iron, he's Iron Man. If you're not old enough to know what that was, don't watch this video. Let's go. Geeks was popping Marvel Legends 20 year anniversary Iron Man. So this is based on series one or supposed to be based on series one, which I actually don't have. I thought I bought it a while back on eBay and I went to go look for it to do the review and realized that I never purchased it. So I don't have it. I got to put that on my Marvel Legends must purchase list. But uh, from what I've seen in some forums and stuff, this is not exactly the same as the first appearance Iron Man. I don't know if the series one Iron Man was supposed to be first appearance Iron Man because first appearance Iron Man, we all know was the Mark I armor. So I don't know what it was based off of. I, I guess I should have done more research for this review, but I'm tired. All right, let's check out the box. Now, before I flip it over, inbox collectors, I get it. I don't want to open this box. Like it's causing me pain to rip this open because it looks so damn good in the box. And there is helmet off, chilling in front of the, what is that, a Stark Expo banner? For 20 years, the Marvel Legends series has brought the iconic characters and storylines of the Marvel Universe to fans worldwide. To celebrate the 2002 Toy Biz debut release, Marvel Legends proudly presents the 20th anniversary series one featuring Captain America, Iron Man, Hulk, and Toad. I'm gonna have to get a suit body for that head. So looking inside the package, it looks like a comic book, but it's actually the diorama backdrop. So it has a comic book cover on one side, the diorama picture on the other. Let's have a brief moment of silence for the packaging. Card back, we're gonna miss you. Diorama backdrop, classic cover. If you're careful, you can get that off easily without ripping it. So we do have accessories. We got two translucent blast effects. There are two black licorice translucent like smoke effects, two fists. You got that Playboy alcoholic head from the late 70s, early 80s. It definitely has that blue wash from the 70s that all the comic book characters used to have in their hair. And there's a diorama backboard and a stand. The stand says Marvel Legends in it. I may attempt to paint it. Mm. I'm not a big fan of the stand. You can't do anything dynamic with it. Or maybe you can, I need to try harder, but that's the only pose I can get his legs in. Can't bend or do anything because the pegs are offset. But but without the stand, mwah, bellissimo. Let's go ahead and bask in his limitless glory. Keith Lee. So shame on me, I never opened my 80th anniversary Iron Man or the Thor or the Captain America. So I won't be whipping him out for comparisons, but I do have a couple of Iron Man we can throw up there. Let's see what this guy can do first. I was always a big fan of this helmet gear because when I was a little kid, that's what he used in the, uh, what was it, the 1966 Iron Man cartoon, I think it was. Or maybe was it from the combo? No, I think it was from that cartoon, but I always liked those little horns there. Paint job looks good. Red all the way down. Now the yellow on here is more of a gold. I think my torch is making it look brighter. Let me see. I don't know if that helps. Three sixty on the head. Little tilt right. Little tilt left. Looking down. Looking up. Not a lot of range either way. Watch the shoulder, folks. The plastic is getting caught right there. I almost took a gouge out of the arm. Had to rotate the shoulder back, push it in, and flip it back forward so I didn't damage it. All right, so arms get up parallel to the shoulder. 
These repulsor hands do not have hinges. Do not try and bend them. I almost snapped mine off. Wingspan. Runs about parallel to the back. Oh boy, call HR. Tony's gotten into the sauce cabinet. Those arms come in close so he can give some hugs. Double jointed elbows give you far better than 90 degrees. Forward crunch. He's limbo ready with that backwards crunch. Is there such thing as backwards crunch? Why, Lord? Why me? You also get a 360 at the waist. Bend over is good. Banana split. Not bad, but not impressive. Thigh rotation is in effect. Grab it and twist. There we go. And ooh, did I feel? Ooh, yes. Calf rotation too. Me love it. Give me all that calf rotation. Feet are on rockers. You can get a full 360. Double jointed knee. Kicks out a bit in the back. You're not making contact with the butt talks at all. He's definitely a prancer. Breach. Leg does not kick back. A little walk range there. Interesting. And you know a playboy like Tony Stark's gonna be a dancer. Toes point straight down flush with the calf. Get a really good angle going up so you can cut a rug. Well, hello there. I'm Tony Stark. I'm Tony Stark from the side. Oh, what's that? You wanna see me from the other side? Oh yeah. Check out my blue wash. Just got it done. Repulsive blast. Iron fist. Get it? And kiss the ring. How tall he be? Six and a half inches. About. With those points. Well, maybe not quite. All right, I lied. A little bit over six and a quarter. Well, hello, friend. Oh, hi. Can I hang out too? Hi, I know I'm just an AI and I don't have legal rights, but I feel like somebody stole my body. So AI Iron Man also came with this helmet. Let's see how it looks on the new Iron Man. It does fit, but you have to repaint the face. The face is more banana yellow compared to the gold of this armor. You got the modern Tony Stark head that came with the, was it the camouflage suit? Not camouflage, yeah, camouflage. Whatever, the uh, Mr. Hyde bath wave. <laughs> stealth suit, stealth suit armor. Not bad, you handsome devil, you. Uh, you can actually use this new head as Tony's dad. That'd be kind of dope. Alright, so in all my years of comic booking, I've never seen Iron Man with black smoke around his arms. Somebody tell me where that's from. Maybe it's something I missed in the more recent years. But, uh, I don't know. This is, but this is based on Series 1, so it should be at least 20 years old. And that was back when I was reading. I don't know what's going on. I even wrapped around the other arm, even though he's not shooting a repulsive blast. I'm cheating. All right, so let me know what you think. Is this a worthy addition to your shelf? Is this just another Iron Man reuse that you can pass on? Sound off in the comments. Let me know what you think. Make sure to hit that like button on your way out. It really helps the channel. You don't understand how much. Subscribe, turn on notifications so you know every time I post a video. Till next time, old school Iron Man is out of here.